Hey guys, my name is Ozzy, and today I'm going to be reacting to this song called Kiki by 6ix9ine featuring Fetty Wap and A Boogie. I saw like a preview of this song like on DJ Academics Instagram page. So I, I heard like, uh, I don't know, some, I don't know, bro, like some of, uh, what's his name song, Takashi 6 9 songs, they kind of sound the same to me. He was like, hey, hey, hey. He, it's like he's screaming, like he, it's like he always screaming. Like, this man screams louder than Meek Mill on his song, so, I don't know, bro. The, he probably got some got some pent-up anger from his childhood. I don't know what that's about. But, uh, besides the point, I'm going to leave a link to the original video in the description, and I'm also going to leave in the comments section below. So, uh, yeah, let's get into this video. Hopefully this video not trash. I, I see A Boogie in this jam, and Fetty Wap, and they both, they both do good hooks. So, uh, I'm, I'm hoping it's going to be great. Let's go ahead and check this out. This ain't kind of loud. Let me let me go ahead, Lord. Trying to hurt my ears. <laughs> Big head on the beat. <laughs> uh, okay. Pause. Hold on. I gotta pause this. Y'all seen that? Those are neighborhood tidies. I, I I already know. Come on, bro. They they throwing it back for everybody in the whole block. Everybody on the block to hit that J. I ain't gonna hold you. They probably bad, but if they let everybody hit, they can't be that bad. I don't. I don't I will just say somebody gonna get mad, but I understand what it is. What it is. <sighs> I'm not trying to pause the music video this much, but my my boy, are you wearing a colorful raccoon tail over your already colorful hair? Takashi, what what are you doing, bro? I, I can't even call you Takashi no more. Takashi, that that's all right. Respectful name, six nine. That's a, that's an interesting facet to what she's making. I don't know if I can get with it. But hey, man, do you? Do you? I'm just saying it's kind of weird. I will go back. But if you want to if you want to go ahead and do that on your own time, you can go ahead and check out the original video. But I ain't going to lie. Them dirt bikes <laughs> remind me of a, of a Meek Millie Villy. <laughs> I said Meek Millie Villy. A Meek Millie video. You know what I'm saying? Meek Millie! <laughs> Cause you know, Meek Mill, he part of the uh, bike life, so you know what I'm saying? Got the ATVs, the four wheelers, all that. But yeah, that, them bikes was tough though. Shawty was thick, I ain't gonna hold you, she was thick. But uh, back to the song. Whoa, Paul, what just happened? They fighting on the block? What's going on? They, they just got arrested? But I gotta, I gotta take that back just a little bit. Hold on, let me go ahead and take that back. Okay. Okay, they, they get into a fight. Damn, bro, like, they, how you gonna put that in the video and not even say what, how, how the fight even started? You just gonna jump straight into the fight. I need some context, bro. For all I know, I, I don't know who to support. I can't just watch a fight and not know who to support. I, I ain't give me no context. They just see one man jumping on top of another man. That's tough. It always weird. You, you know, you know, you know the fight getting too crazy when somebody on top of somebody else. Kind of sus, but hey, you know what I'm saying? You can't should have just hit it with the one-two combo, you know what I'm saying? Just, just. just I'm swinging on the man, you know what I'm saying? I'm just saying, he could have knocked that man out. But now he's trying to jump on top of the man in the fight. There's something about you we don't know. Oh my god, I really need to stop watching So Luminati's videos. I, I keep, his lingo is rubbing off on me. I'm, I can't go like that. Yikes. Takashi, how am I going to react to this video if y'all keep throwing cheeks in the video like this? Y'all trying to get me flagged. Kids. I'm, now I gotta censor it, because that's just too inappropriate. So I'm gonna have to edit the joint and censor that joint out. Good, thank you. I, I appreciate that. You just, you just wilding out, huh? Don't know how to act. But yeah, this song kind of cranky so far. On the regular! <laughs> that joint kind of tough. Regular. Hey, the shoulder joint. I'm sorry, but they, they didn't have to do it like that. They put the camera a little too close to my boy's face. We get it, you got that colorful grill. Colorful diamonds. I don't know, bro. That, that grill, I can't get with it. When Lil Yachty did it, I didn't like it. When 6 9 did it, I still don't like it. Like, grills are already doing too much. But if you're going to do a grill, I mean, at least get it iced out. You got to be like my boy Quavo Hunter. You know what I'm saying? Quavo, that man got the good grills. Him and uh, Kodak Black, they got, they got the best grills in the rap game. That man, Quavo, Kodak Black, diamonds on the... <laughs> I'm saying... 
But Lil Wayne did it better. Lil Wayne, he had the the OZ diamonds on on his teeth. <laughs> Brush your diamonds, he said. That man, that man, funny. Lil Wayne, he's a goat. But I'm sorry, I I, I can't get with these colorful uh, colorful girls. Nah, I can't do it. Hey, the song cranked though. He got on top of the. He got on top of the. Uh, why? Why is everybody? Every single rapper trying to do that now. I, like all these. Every time I watch like an underground rapper's video, somebody they're out at a basketball court, they're on the block, they're in front of a liquor store, or they're on top of a, a basketball hoop. I don't know what the theme is here. I I, I no. Let me give you a theory. I think what they're trying to say is, oh yeah, I'm really I'm really from here. I'm really from the streets. So let me go ahead and post it up somewhere in my neighborhood so people know that I'm from around this area. I think that's what they're trying to say because they're trying to say they're still about this life. You're not going to catch me lacking. I mean, I'm not going to lie. This man running like a hundred deep. He got the whole neighborhood on his side. So, I mean, clearly the hood rocking with him. Even though his, his hair a little suspicious. But clearly his hood rocking with him. That or he paying a good money to be in this video. Yeah, you never know. I'm I'm not gonna lie, bro. But if you if you ever see this man on the street and you and he said he from the block, I would think this man lying because he got his hair got more colors than a clown, bro. That that's yeah. Anyway, enough about his hair, bro. I I, I could make a whole video talking about his hair, but I, honestly, I don't really care. I'm just talking about it because I'm looking at this video. Yeah. But anyway, oh yeah, Fetty Wap in this video too. You know that man got. <laughs> I think his hair, that's his actual hair now, because when he first came into the rap game, like, 20, 2016-ish, he had, like, fake dreadlocks, but I think he actually has real dreads now, so, you know, good for him, you know, the, the thing about when you're growing out your dreadlocks, like, you, you be looking weird when, they, when they're really short, we call that the Chief Keef effect, when they're looking short, people just think you're looking wild, and it just don't look good until it gets to, like, the shoulder length, so I, I can see why he, 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 he didn't want to look rusty, he said, I'm, I'm too rich. I'm a millionaire. I don't gotta look dusty while I'm growing out my locks. You know what I'm saying? He got he got, he bought real dreadlocks from a lady. So you know that's that's actually pretty smart. I, I can't even hate on him for that. That's smart. Uh, oh yeah, this is this is the part that I seen in the snippet. We were busting on the cuffs on the regular. <laughs> I can't even I can't even imitate. I haven't heard a Fetty Wap song in a long time. The last song I heard about Fetty Wap was like, "And you wake up in the morning, mom's yelling in your room." Like, can I get five more minutes? I ain't really tripping over school. Let's get it. Where's Khalifa? Ha -ha. But yeah, that song was lit, though. I mean, Fetty Wap not dropping. But then again, if you think about it, Fetty Wap dropped like 20 hit songs in 2016 alone. He was dropping My Way. Uh, what was it? 679. What else? He dropped Trap Queen. He did a whole bunch of songs. Like, my goodness. Like, I think almost every song on his album, Fetty Wap, was a hit. This man had a lot of plot, had a lot of songs going gold in that year. It's just that I guess he he didn't drop a second album, so that's where he fell. Out. He dropped like one mixtape or something, but like, you know, people not really checking for mixtapes like that unless like you have like a whole bunch of hits on the mixtape. But he's not broke though, so clearly he's still doing shows and stuff like that. But if you don't want to lose your core audience, you gotta drop more albums because you know your fans slash supporters they want to hear more music. But yeah, let me get back to this. Damn, bro, can you imagine, like, 12 years from now, you, you got to think about your daughter. This is this is the type of females, they be doing this on the regular. That's, I'm trying to turn to the song, but I, I can't just, just let the lyrics pass my head. If girls doing this on the regular, it's going to be hard to trust any type of female. I'm, I'm just saying. She doing, she, she giving top on the regular, her mouth always open, and she not eating food? <laughs> Yikes, bro, that's a, that's a rap. I don't, I don't know about all that, man. It's... That's your girl? Could it be me? But the hook straight though. My man, my man's my man's turned out. He's doing the little <laughs> the little Baltimore joint. Damn, bro, like this whole video, people getting jumped in the background. They they like, they like oh yeah, get, go ahead, get that in the video. It's, it's gonna it's gonna make the video look harder. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna make the video look more gangster. Damn, bro. Homeboy in the back, they, they just jumped on him like that? They didn't have to do homeboy like that. Like, they already making money off the song. They they gonna make money off the dude again jump in the back. When he in, when he in his hood, he's he not gonna be able to look at nobody in the same. Oh, you the dude that got jumped in the uh in the Kiki video. 
they gonna be clowning that man, bro. Now he don't got no choice. He gotta move out. He gotta move off the block. And how are you gonna move off the block if you living on the block? You living on the block for a reason. It's tough out here. The cost of living way too high. But not. I'm, I'm getting sidetracked. Just hook straight though. I ain't gonna hold you. Just hook straight. Everybody. Th why everybody throwing? Why everybody throwing gang signs? I know there's no way all of them are in the game, bro. There's no way. Some of these people fake rapping. We 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 gotta know. Some of these people I know they're not in the game, bro. They just they just trying to get in the video. But anyway, my my man creasing up the full. Hold on, you, you see where this mouse is circling? Why my boy gotta do that to the motorsport force like that? Why? Who who told you to crease up your shoes like that? My boy, there's so many shoes you could have done that to. Not the fours. That's my favorite model, by the way. I repeat them fours that he just creased the mess out of. My my my, my man's out here, <laughs> Millie Rocket, all over the place, you know what I'm saying? But he turned up. I see he lit. That bootleg, Millie Rock. Do this stop. Fetty Wap, I see him. He doing something different. I like it. To the top. <laughs> that's that's kind of tough. I, I can't imitate it, but that that's that's tough. Sound good. I like it. I'm sorry, but I I'm not gonna go back. But my boy, why are your pants sagging that low? Ain't nobody trying to see your boxes. I'm just trying to listen to a music. Hold on, pause. I'm trying to listen to the music and watch the music video. I ain't need to see all that. Put your pants up. It's 2018. You wearing designer belts and you sagging? Pause. No good, foul, red card, all that. Just, just get it out of here, bro. Tripping. Oh, there go my boy A Boogie. A Boogie with the hoodie. <laughs> I'm in my bag now. <laughs> that man be making hits. Damn, bro. He, he, he exposed him to double standard. He said, if I'm a player, you a slut. <laughs> if you a slut, I'm a player. That's facts, though. You know what I'm saying? We we gotta accept these double standards. But I mean, let's let's be real though. If if a guy a player, he a slut too. If a girl a player, she a slut too. Just keep it simple. But you know, you know how it be when you when you around your home. You go, oh yeah, you you bagged there. Oh that. Oh you hit that thing. Your, all your homeboys gonna be like, oh yeah, you, you did that, bro. You, you the man out here. If a girl did that, you're like, girl, you girl, you sloppy. You messy. You, with him? <laughs> you tripping, tripping. <laughs> But yeah, people be wild out here, bro. Y'all, y'all need, y'all need, y'all need Jesus. That so-called protection that you wear, <laughs> you're gonna catch STD one day. You're gonna be sick. Your mom gonna be looking at you like, now Janice, I done told you to stop messing with them boys from across the block. I told you they ain't no good for you. But anyway, I'm, I'm, I'm getting off topic. Hey, he just, he just made a uh, NBA young boy reference. <laughs> He said, you my 38, I love you. Because, you know, I ain't never leaving the house without my 38. Because if, 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 I, if I got that 38 on me, <laughs> you already know what's going on. <laughs> I'm busting that. You don't even hold a 38 like that. But, you know, I don't, I don't shoot guns. So, <laughs> don't look at me. I'm just saying, though. If he leaving the house, he not leaving without the 38. Because he loves the 38. If the I try, try to pull up on him, try to snatch the chain, he going to bust with the 38. That's what's up. Yo, bruh, anytime a video does the little distortion of the head, Jane, it'd be making your head look bigger. It's always so funny. Like, I don't know why. It's just so entertaining. I, I gotta go back. Just, like, gotta go back a little bit. That was, that was funny. <laughs> that distortion, bruh. Hey, that man riding the dirt bike. He, he killing it. Bruh, if I could... If I could ride a dirt bike like that, bro, and I, I'm just hitting, bruh, I don't know how they be doing it, bro, because, like, if I'm if I'm riding a dirt bike, like, I'm, my, my mind is just like, hey, bro, I only got a helmet. If I fall, I could really have died. That's scary, bro. I, they fearless and they stupid at the same time, because all, all it take, just one, just one medium-sized rock in the road. It's a wrap. Tumor. Concussion. You done. You probably like, dang, Ozzy, you a real bug. I'm like, nah, my mom a nurse. Anytime I went outside the house without a helmet, she would bug me. She, she showed me a video of someone getting a concussion. I was like, okay, I'm going to wear a helmet from now on. I can't feed. Homeboy's head real life split open. Like, he was bleeding. Like, he couldn't move. 
Let's just say that boy wasn't skating no more. I'm just saying, if you're a professional, that's cool. But like, even in the F game, they gotta wear a helmet. So you know, I'm just saying, guy, gotta, gotta be safe out here. These streets dangerous. Even if you're not from the hood, <laughs> these streets dangerous. Oh, he let him wear the chain. <laughs> if someone lets you wear the chain, that means that's a shooter right there. He's shooting for the squad. Don't just let you wear the chain if you're not doing nothing for the squad. I'm just saying. Dang, that, that's it? That, that's it? That, that's that's his whole verse? Like, that's not even a hook. That's that's just like, they, they, they just said we just need a couple of extra lines. Dang, 6 9 I thought you was balling. You just spent 150000 on a chain. You couldn't. You couldn't drop like a, a good twenty thousand more to get a full verse. I don't know, bro. He he must have not given him a big enough bag for that verse, cause that was kind of short. Uh, that that verse was like twenty seconds long. Like that jam was tough, but it's this, this his verse was too short. Hey, buggy, too talented for you to just pay him for a short verse. He didn't have a big enough bag. That's all it could be. But yeah, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, go ahead, leave a big thumbs up. What's your favorite part about the song? I ain't gonna lie, Takashi's part, it was alright. I mean, nothing nothing new. It's just him scream rapping again as usual. I'll be up on the regular. I'm a like, I, I get it, bro. You're, you're loud. You can rap loud. We, we get it. We already have Meek Mill. And at least if Meek Mill rapping loud, he's being lyrical. You know what I'm saying? He, he rapping about the rollie. How much ice he got on the wrist. How he was chasing the dream. So... When Meek Mill gets lyrical and he's screaming, at least he's screaming some bars. Takashi, your music, your music's straight. But like, dang, bro, you gotta switch it up just a little bit. You know what I'm saying? You a new artist. I get it. This is like your third hit. Don't do the same thing too much. I mean, you might you might end up getting the Fetty Wap treatment. Fetty Wap, he was doing the same thing too much. I think people start losing interest. I mean, his music's still good. But if you want to keep your audience, you gotta continue to develop your sound and do a little bit more different thing. Hey Boogie, I'm I'm just disappointed that your verse was that short. Takashi, next time you get a big artist on your song, just pay up a larger amount and get a better feature. Like the feature was good, but it was too short. Now I'm gonna have to keep playing. I'm gonna I'm gonna replay the song just to listen to A Boogie's part. I ain't gonna hold you. Like the part was 30 seconds long, but that melody. That melody was infectious. That's why if you get someone like A Boogie on the song, he's gotta be on the hook at least. That way you have like him more in the song. Hey bro, secure the bag though. Hey boy, secure the bag. He he probably got paid like fifteen just to do twenty seconds. <laughs> I wish I could. I wish I could get paid to get paid fifteen k just to sing a hook, sing a melody in the song for thirty seconds. But anyway, if you guys like that song, go ahead and leave a comment below. Tell me what you liked about the song. Was it trash? Was it good? Did you like it? Was it even good? Uh, someone just sent me a message. But uh, yeah. If you guys like this video, go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. If you want to watch the original video, I'm going to leave a link in the description below. And yeah, I'm out. Peace.